that hello hi i exist uh hi i exist i am vtuber greenster now i am still completely new to this i have gone to the dark side we're gonna play some uh, btd6 i guess uh, let's just do something simple. Actually, wait, can we do get onto it? Ah, oh, no, we can't. Let's do, we'll do alternate balloon rounds right now. I was gonna do impoppable, but why not? We'll do this. And of course, if you're not gonna be able to see everything, but it's still good nonetheless, I guess. Alright, so what I want is I'm gonna put you there, and then yeah, of course you can't see it well. Let me, uh, let me see if I can move my body a bit. Ooh, just a tiny bit. Nope, that's not what I wanted. Uh, nope. There I go. Uh, just move you. We can shorten up you. Yeah. There we go. Okay. I guess that'll be good for right now. You guys can at least see everything. So then, let us begin. Uh, what I want to do is put you up here. Get. I want to get. Um, a zero two two buccaneer as quickly as possible. That way, we'll start shredding through early game with both camos and leads. Uh, okay, camos. Nice, we got camo detection. Alright, now we just need, uh, oh wait, yeah, shoot, leads are gonna start popping up soon. So we need that lead popping power as well, which is why the buccaneer is, like, super good for this. I could've also done camo detection on my dart monkey, but, I mean, then again, the buccaneer just has so much more popping power than the dart monkey here. Especially 022, which we just got. Which is nice. Um... Oh, speak of speak of the devil. There's the leads that were that we uh, so dreadfully wanted to try to avoid. Um, I forgot we're going around 80 on this. That's right. I go for. I want to go for Churchill as much as I can. So I get Churchill early. I'll have some good popping power, at the expense of maybe losing to some group ceramics. I don't know. I just don't know what I should do. We're actually making pretty good progress thanks to this Buccaneer. This is why the, the 022 Buccaneer is overpowered. Alright, nice. We got uh, Churchill going. Put him on last. That way when he gets the machine gun, he... Uh, the cannon will target the last balloons while the machine gun will target the first one. And now we wait. Uh, actually, we don't have a lot of defense now, do we? Uh, I think it should be okay. I'm mainly using the Buccaneers, but I mean, I feel like I could put down a Dartling or something. I get these monkey pirates up to, yeah, the cannon ship. That's what I need. That way we have at least a little bit more popping power, especially for the early Moabs. And then, I also want to get another Buccaneer to put at here. Uh, that way we get a Destroyer and soon into, uh, what is it? The Airship Carrier. Because those are actually significantly helpful to some balloon popping power. Okay, we're actually getting very well done. See, now the, uh, let's see if I can actually enable. Hold on a second. I need to go to the properties. Yeah. Okay. And, uh, there we go. Okay, now. There we go. Now you can see my little cursor. Uh, so you can see what I'm cursing on. So now the dude has a little machine gun. And the cannon here will attack the blast balloons here while the rest of them will 
go up here and be targeted by the machine gun, allowing for a little bit more popping power from the cannon to the back, as well as the machine gun in the front, which adds for a spicy combo on Churchill. Which is why I love using him so much. Churchill is like the best hero to ever resist. You can't quote me on that. You know, I never noticed how quick work the the sharpshooter, the crossbow master here, makes quick work of zebras. Yeah, see, there's the, the reinforced Moab, which is not that great. Thankfully, that's why we bought the destroyer, so that he can easily pummel through it, even if it's reinforced. But we're starting to lack defenses, but as soon as I get the monkey pirates, we should be able to start building some extra defenses here. The first thing I want to get is... Um, you know, that's actually a good question. What do I want to get? Engineers would probably be nice, but I'm, more, I'm so very used to having uh, buccaneers, like, everywhere. Like, although I could put down a portable lake, actually, now that I think about it. Which is actually, why don't, why don't I do that? I'm used to having buccaneers around, so I'm just going to put down a portable lake. Okay, I'll put one there. Uh, put another one. Can I put one more? One more? Come on. Let me film one more. Get in there. Okay, I guess not. Uh, I'll just sell you and make you nice. Uh, put you right there. All right, can I put one more anywhere? All right, no. So, uh, for this one, why don't we just do the same thing? Put you on that, and then... So you're a cannon ship, and I want you to be a destroyer. Churchill will probably take care of most of the work when he reaches level 10. When he gets that ability. I could... What I could do is start preparing for the later rounds here. If I can get it. Uh, hopefully that doesn't affect it too much. What I should be able to do. Yeah, that's gonna... I mean, it's not too bad. What I can do is I want to put a there. I'm going to put it on close. I don't remember adding them, adding this option too, but whatever. Um, that. I, I do want to get some protection. That's what she said. It's the camo regrow lids. It's got to be the dumbest thing ever because, like, you have a map, right? And, like, think of it as, like, an ascension path, like, kind of like in, uh, kind of like this game, kind of. So, like, you have the red bloom, you go to the blue bloom. Then it's, what, green, then yellow, then pink. And then through that, you have two options. You have black balloons or white balloons. And then those will either go towards the lead balloons or the zebra balloons. Like, the lead is a is an off-leading path. Like, once you reach the lead balloon, that, that's one path. But then you go to the zebra balloons, and then you have the rainbow, then ceramic, and then Moab, then BFB, then... Z-O-M-G, and then the B-A-D. Uh, I mean, well, technically, I guess if you do choose the lead path, you go to D-D-T. I guess that's like a Moab upgrade, kind of. I think I can fit a dartling. Oh, I can fit a dartling here. That'd actually be nice. I don't think I'd be able to fit a dartling here. If you couldn't tell, some of my towers are named after the mercs from TF2. Yeah, you know, like you got the scout, heavy weapons guy, the medic. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> I mean, I guess the ability was right here. I could really even have a choice. Um, so I got. Let's see. So I got. I should. I need to rename that. Actually, I need to rename. I was gonna do this earlier. Rename you. Just... Yeah. Don't don't ask why. Just 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 don't ask. You know, I think it actually no, actually it make more sense if I do Pat Fusty as Saxton Hill. Now that I think about it. Ah. 
Maybe not. We're nearing the end of the, the game. We shouldn't have too much trouble. If I can get a fourth tier Dartling, this would actually speed up the balloon popping power significantly. But we're actually making steady progress. Oh, it's so close. Boom. Yeah, he's firing his lasers. Look at this. Look at this destruction. It's going right through my head. This guy is currently firing a laser through my head. <laughs> Boom. Alright, now comes for the the final wave, which is just this guy. Wait, isn't there a reinforced UMG on this wave too? Or is, is that it? No, that can't be it. Yeah, here it is, here it is. Or was it oh, is it just two of the UMGs? No, wait. You know, honestly, I forget what alternate balloon rounds was. Either way, we're making quick work of the ZOMG. Hey! We won! Yay! Alright, so, uh, that was, uh, BTD6. If you guys like me more, um, so if you guys, uh, if you guys like me like this, or if you prefer the old me standing up in the corner up there, then, uh, let me know down in the comments because I actually kind of enjoy this. This is, uh, it's kind of fun. So, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video whenever that comes out. Bye-bye.